Hi, my name is Anwar Abdullah. I'm the founder of Ocean Quest Global. Today, what we're going to talk about is the organic coral propagation system. So, without further ado, let's uh, have a look at the video. The process of coral propagation begins with planting strategy, meaning that even the time of day when the coral are planted is considered. The best time for propagating coral is in the morning or in the late afternoon when the temperature is not too warm for the corals. Time period between extraction and collecting to Completion of the propagation must not exceed one hour or 60 minutes. From the process table, the coral is moved to a holding station where the quality of the bonding is checked before it is moved. Throughout the process, the coral must be kept wet at all times. From the holding station, the coral is transported to a designated nursery where they will be placed and let to grow. In the organic coral propagation system, we do half the work and nature do the other half. The maintenance of our coral nursery is mostly done by the grazers like the parrotfish and rabbitfish which feeds on the algae that is growing on the rocks. Therefore, we are free to do other things in the coral nursery such as monitoring the corals for disease and help quarantine that is not healthy. We also do coral growth monitoring and also migration of species. We record every living marine organism that comes and stay in the nursery area. Migration of species into the nursery is important to us because all the marine organisms are connected through the harmonious ecological cycle and they contribute towards maintaining the nursery itself. One of the strengths of the organic approach of coral propagation is that its ability to recreate diversity and prevent monoculture. Many kind of corals and crusting digitate, finger light, or tin plate, even gorgonian and soft coral can be propagated. These are the corals that will become the parent colony for the replenishment of damaged coral reefs. The organic system is the system that truly supports restoration of diversity and abundance of the coral reefs. The organic coral reef rehabilitation system's advantage over artificial system are cost effectiveness, zero environmental risk, maximum community engagement, non-polluting, and promotes abundance right from the start. Now that you have the basic idea of how the organic coral propagation works, if you need more information, you can always contact us or sign up with one of our training.